Hey everybody, welcome back. It is now morning day 42 and I was digging out the bedroom and we ran into a pocket of ore. So I want to get all this ore, as much as of it as you can. This is the first ore we've seen down here in a long time. So it's actually kind of welcome. Although I am kind of happy that we haven't ran into any ore, to tell you the truth, because I needed all that stone. I didn't, and I had enough uh, scrap iron from the other pockets of ore that I didn't really need it. So we actually kind of got really lucky with our underground base not having ore, to tell you the truth. Although it's not really lucky because chances are, nine times out of ten, you'll find a nice area like this full of stone where there's no ore. And to tell you the truth, I'm just going to have to replace everything that doesn't, you know, symmetrically work for what I've dug out here. But I need all this scrap iron. So yeah, it's a welcome. It's welcome, that's for sure. grab anything that's not ore down here because I'm gonna have to replace it damn it there we go I think we actually already got all the ore to tell you the truth there wasn't that much here 643 yeah that's not very much but anyways this is gonna be the master bedroom I've kind of reworked it a little bit this is going to be a wall, this is going to be the door, that's going to be a wall, this is going to be a wall, this is going to be a walk-in closet, and this is going to be the bathroom over on this side. I'm not too sure how big I want this to be, but we are going to need more stone, and I do want this to be a bit bigger, so we are going to make this a little bit bigger. So maybe I should just time-lapse a little bit of this, because it's not going to take long. now. We do have some stone now thankfully so we can get some uh, more concrete mix and more concrete blocks basically made up. Uh, I managed to make up a few more so I don't know how much we're gonna need exactly. I think what we'll do is we'll take what we've already made and then we'll we'll go start placing them down and we'll just make them as we need them now because I don't want to make too many and I'm not a real good judge at how many we actually need. So. In fact, I'm actually going to take this out because stone is really precious right now. And we do have lots of cement. So I'm kind of going to make it on a, on a base. We have 260 blocks already right now. And yes, we are going to need cement, but that is really fast to pump out through the the forges here. Like, that won't take long. That'll take six minutes. Another two minutes here to get 200 there. And yeah, the, the forges go by quick, so what takes a while is doing the blocks. 
simply because they have to they take so much stone like I, I just want to make sure we have enough stone for everything and for some reason my potato plants won't plant here or here they just drop and explode and I've tried I've dug up the dirt and replaced it and hold it I don't know what the hell changed that that made it do that but I think we're gonna have to tear up all of this freaking crop and just so those potatoes can grow I don't know we'll figure something out in the long run for now we're just gonna leave it though let's just get our wall made actually one thing I want to do is I want to put our lip around the edge here so that uh, the spider zombies can't climb up on this side of the wall before the horde comes. This is going to take a while I think. Oh that's better. Yeah, I think the wall is high enough. I'm going to go two out with this once we upgrade it. But for now, it's just going to be one. I don't want to use iron bars to shoot through. That's not that's not what this wall is for. I'm not going to be standing up here shooting at them. The spikes are going to take care of them. If I want to go out there and kill them, I'll go out there and kill them with grain alcohol and weapons. Like, real, like, guns and stuff. And in the morning, I can t I can use uh, melee weapons or and a bow. There we go. We are gonna have to get some sort of a way in. Besides that frickin' tunnel over there. And I'm not too sure where we're going to put that or do that, but that's not my main concern right now. We'll just get this lip up so that we can drag the zombies along this wall. And I think day 43 is actually when the horde comes. I'm not 100% sure. I, I think it is. So like we have tomorrow night, until tomorrow night to get as much of this ready for them as possible. Now just in case they spawn over here, this is why I'm putting them here. Like start attacking this wall, which I'm not going to plan on that. But it'll give us something. A bit of protection. Because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be facing that way. I'm going to stand in the middle of this wall, <coughs> right about here. I'm going to face that way when they spawn, so that they spawn over there. So I'm almost 100% positive that you can control where they spawn by doing that. As long as you don't turn and move and look somewhere else at the last second. Just do half a wall at a time sort of deal. Oh, that scared me. There, we'll just do this. We'll just continue on down. We'll go as far as we can. Can't really upgrade the spikes anymore. At least not until we start getting more more scrap iron. And to be honest, the only, there's only one way to get scrap iron now, and that's through Omni Gel, either through stone. Well, I mean, we could find another pocket of resources, but I don't really feel like digging in areas looking for it. To tell you the truth, because chances are more more likely than not we won't find any that way.
Yeah, we might have to dig up all of this at some point. Put like blocks underneath, and then put dirt on top. Like I want, it, like, cause it, you need to make it perfectly flat, and not have like a little bit of variation going up and down and up and down, like along the just the way the voxels kind of meld. Let's put this away. Let's put our sand away. Now we have scrap iron, but I'm not going to put that towards steel as of yet. Um, well, a thousand of them we will. A thousand of it we will. Okay, so how many blocks do we have? Yeah, we're gonna need a whole shitload. Cause what what did we have to begin with there? About two hundred and some. Yeah, that didn't last very long. See, that's the thing. It's like I don't know how we got this wall to go all the way around with only a thousand when that seemed like that was two hundred, and we only did like one little lip and a little bit over there and a little bit over there. Yeah, we're gonna need like another. My guess is at least 800 blocks to finish the wall fully. And any sand that we need, we have to go and dig it out. So we are going to need more. So we have to put in 4,000 more stone here. That's a must. to get any steel right now. Where's all of our steel? Okay, so we have no more steel. I want to wait till we have another three stacks or something like that before we go and take it out and upgrade more spikes with it. I just want to get the wall done. It's taking so long and I need so much stone. Like, I think I'm out of stone now. Look at this, I'm out of stone again. So, like, I have to go mine. I think I have to. Oh, man. You know what we can do? Maybe. Uh, our athletics is at 100, so that's great. I'm thinking we'll go with tool smithing. Buy two of that. This gives us the chainsaw, so we need 80 to get the chainsaw and the auger. So I'm thinking we'd start with the auger, just plow out some some uh, <coughs> plow out some stone somewhere else. Even see, I don't mind doing it if it's with the auger. Going to There, so we'll buy the auger. Next is like we can make an engine, but we don't... Well, yeah, we're going to need that too, because we're going to need that to craft the auger. Because uh, chances are we won't be able to find one by wrenching cars. Oh, man. I don't even know if I have a radiator. Yeah, I don't. And we would have to wrench cars for a radiator just to build the engine. So that was kind of pointless, spending those skill points. Because basically, we're going to have to go back down. Or... You know what? Let's take a quick look out here. Hmm. 
Just thinking. I do need to get down there somehow without dying. Without taking damage. So what we'll do is... We'll head out through here. Because we want a way in. So I want to get a way in. We do have cobblestones for 33 blocks. Not a lot, but it's something. So let's head out this way. Go outside. The safe way. Excellent. And I want to make a way in. Oh, I didn't. Either they broke it or I didn't upgrade it. I think I upgraded it earlier. Now the way in, I don't want it to interfere with my frickin' spikes that I've got set up. But I don't think there's going to be any way around that. And there's, that's where all the screamers are coming from all the time. So let's make... And I want an entrance kind of at each corner. Like one here, and one here, kind of symmetrical. So we'll go like... One, two, three blocks in like this, on this block. Basically, and it's going to be a ramp here. There's going to be another thing there, and I want a two wide, two wide gap. Is that what I was doing over there, or was it a three wide gap? I can't remember now. I have a ramp. Yeah, and I want two wide. So hopefully I can make this jump. Because I want it three wide. And hopefully we have enough frames to do this. I'm just doing something so we probably wait. That's not freaking mining. You guys have seen enough mining, I think. But at the same time, it's like... That's what I've got left to do. Okay, so I can make that jump even right now. So, nothing to worry about there. Especially once I get another one sticking out there. I can barely make it, but I can make it. Okay, so that's a way in. An easy way in. Ah, oh, we need more stone. We could go try wrench a car. I mean, we are ready for the horde, at least. On this wall. How about before we do anything? Looking for wrenches and stuff like that for cars. Let's go like this. Let's head out. Let's upgrade all of our spikes out here. It'll be easier for me to fall down over here, but I just I needed a way out. I wasn't thinking about this when I went out my other way, but it's fine. Get all these up to steel. All the ones that are already scrap iron at least. So that way we don't have to worry about them melting away all of our iron. If that makes any sense. It does to me anyway. See like I'm going to have them from here. They're probably going to be going at it from here to here. Get this all done up to full steel. Then 
and everything else would be bonus. Yeah, we got a decent wall now. This wall is ready for hordes. Well, almost all of it. I almost don't want to upgrade these to scrap iron, but we're already doing it now. There, so we're out. That's fine. Okay, so now what we'll do is We'll head in. We'll grab our wrench. And we're going to go on a hunt for some engines. That's what we're going to do. So if I can get an auger, that'll make things a little bit smoother for us grabbing stone. And we can go dig anywhere we want for stone. Like, in a hurry. Might even find some ore. You never know. Like, I can make all the cement I want out of this, but I have no stone to back it up. There, so... Just go like that. Keep a little bit of stone so that we can make a bit more concrete mix. Okay, we've got 65 more. So maybe we should go place them down. Just continue the wall. I do want to get an auger up and running next. So that will be a, a focus a thing to focus on. But I do want to get this wall done before anything else really so yeah this won't take long and we'll have this section done That it? That's it. So we're out of blocks now. There is cars out here we can go get nice and easy and quick. So let's go and try and get some engines, I think. I think, I think. If I can get an auger. Oh, I don't have gas. Well, I have a little bit, don't I? 833. <laughs> That's probably enough for like two seconds of auger. Do we have a wrench? Do. Okay, so let's go. Let's see if we can get lucky with uh find a frickin' engine. Uh, 
and I gotta get going here soon, so we gotta make this quick. Okay, let me through. Loot them first, obviously. Come on, engine. Come on, engine. should have ate before we came out here, but we'll survive, we'll survive. Got a headlight. Maybe we'll get lucky with this one, I don't know. Who knows? Yes, we got an engine. 450 quality engine, boys and girls. Awesome. Should we continue? I mean, we got what we needed. I'm rather, rather surprised that we even did, to tell you the truth. Damn it. Damn you zombies, why can't you just break open a path for me? Huh? Damn it. Okay, so we got what we needed, so... I'm kind of inclined to just... Going, uh, this is faster. Oh, yeah. Just be careful. <laughs> I thought there was freaking hay bales down at the bottom. I would have killed myself. That would have been just awesome. Okay, so. We got our engine. Let's go take a look at, uh, the auger parts. We should be able to make an auger right now. And I need to eat. Oh my god, stop jumping at an angle. Okay. No, auger's gonna be over at the smithing table. Oops. Oh, or it's not. Maybe I put it at the forge. I don't know. I haven't tried to make it yet. I can't remember. Yeah, here we go. Auger blade. Okay, so we need iron in there for this. So let's make one auger blade. One auger parts. Six hundred quality, that's freaking awesome. That's because our miscellaneous crafting skill is all the way up. Get rid of that nail. Okay, so let's put not there. Okay. What do we need to make the auger? I'm pretty sure that it would be at the smithing table, no? If it's not at the smithing table, then it's gotta be at the crafting table. Unless I have it just here. Oh no, it's an assembly, isn't it? Yeah, it is, okay. So what do I need? I need a small engine. See, I haven't tried to freaking make an auger before in a long time. If ever. Where's my auger? Boom. We have a frickin' 533 quality auger to play with. Oh. 
Oops, what am I doing? Put this stuff away. Where did it go? Where did it go? There it is. Come on, hurry up. Now we could go get gas from cars by wrenching them some more. That's always an option. Oh, we do have some radiators. So we could make some engines. Okay, so... Let's fill up our auger. And... I think that that is actually going to do it for this episode, guys. Next episode is going to be me augering out something. See, that's the thing. is That's why I kind of want to cut this episode right now is because... It's because I don't know where the heck I want to auger. I do need to auger out all this. I need to auger out all this dirt eventually. But not right now. I need to eat before I do anything. So... Yeah, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Uh, if you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.